former Deputy Prime Minister Datuk Seri Ahmad Zahid Hamidi, who earlier today arrived at around 10 a.m. here at MACC headquarters in Putrajaya, will be assisting roughbusters into two separate corruption cases. Now, as you can see right next to me, the amount of microphones that have been set up has shown you the amount of interest not only local but also foreign media have taken into this issue. Let us find out more about this case and whether or not this will be the breakthrough we've all been waiting for. Dato Sri Ahmad Zahid arrived at about 10 a.m. in a black Toyota Fellfire and was seen in a cheerful mood as he smiled and waved to the media, waiting outside the main entrance of the building before he was escorted in by MACC personnel. The former Deputy Premier then exited the building at 6.30 p.m. and told reporters that he will be required to come again to finish giving his statement to the Graf Busters tomorrow. However, no time was given. Tadi saya baru selesai memberikan uh, keterangan uh, terhadap isu 1MDB. Besok akan disambung uh, persoalan mengenai Yayasan Akal Budi dan saya akan maklumkan besoklah. Ini terutamanya uh, kenyataan yang saya buat Ketika saya bertemu dengan wakil uh, keluarga Raja Saudi ya? Jadi itu perlukan detail ya? Kerana uh, maklumat itu cuma diperolehi daripada media Jadi saya berikan detail kepada mereka Yesterday, MACC Deputy Chief Commissioner of Operations Datuk Sri Azam Baki confirmed that they have requested Datuk Sri Ahmad Zahid to come to their headquarters to have his statement recorded one of the cases being probed included allegations that funds from his family-run foundations were used for personal gain. One Izul Islam, 7 Edition.